you said when you came out, which I thought was quite interesting, you said, I don't really like to admit this, she was violent, we yeah. both made mistakes, but she was very controlling. Yeah. And I felt like she called the shots in yeah. this relationship. Well, she, she locked me in the flat one day. She locked and, you in the flat? Yeah, she locked me in the flat. Obviously, me being angry, I didn't know the door was locked. I've gone over, I've grabbed the door handle, pulled it, and it's come straight off in my hands. So we're stuck on a three-storey uh, three flat, and I've had to jump off a three-storey balcony. I ripped all my legs <laughs> open, all my back, all my legs, the lot, and I ended up in hospital, you know, because she won't let me out of the house. It's not funny, though. So, um, Can I tell you why it's not funny? And I don't want to upset maybe. any of the audience, because I completely appreciate the fact that you're here, but I'll tell you why I don't think you should laugh. If this was the other way around and a woman was sat here and a bloke had locked her in a flat and she had to jump out and injured herself, you lot would not be laughing. You would be saying, he's a complete nightmare, he should be locked up and that's disgraceful. But somehow, if it happens to a bloke, that's funny. That's not funny, is it? That is it. I, I was more of a man not hitting her back. Told my team, she told my team she would give you black eyes. Yeah, well, I went to the black eye, a fat lip and everything, you know. Hitting me. Uh, she, she used to say I was bad because I was one who turned around and, yeah, yeah, I did put my hands through doors and punch walls and stuff. What a great I, environment I, in which I, to bring I, two children. I'd up. rather do that than it her. It's a uh, double standard. Yeah, um, you know. So, it, it, it sucks, man. It's true, too, man. It, uh, I mean, that girl looked fucking psychotic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. she, she looked like she about to pop out and just, like, beat his ass already. I was like, damn, <laughs> dog. Like she, she's been um, starving his ass. You can, you can tell she's been <laughs> yeah, eating yeah, yeah, everything yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Damn, I feel the but, pain, dude. <sighs> it's, a, it's like the stigma that people have on male. Yeah. Uh, that they're supposed to be strong and yada yada yada. But you know that's not the case. You know what I'm saying? Everybody should be treated treated equal. Yeah. You know, uh, especially like. For instance, uh, we have in America they favor females to uh, when they when a, a when a male and a female get divorced, are they the courts favor the female to take care of the kids? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When okay. I think, so, so I, th I, th I think that's I think that's kind of reasonable too, because like. Um... I mean, it's, it's we're looking at like the biology, right? Because like you know, women are more like you know, no, no. Na na so, more nutrient, nature yeah. for uh, for the kids, and they're okay. uh, more like, compatible. Sometimes that that is true, but I mean, at the end of the day, the kids they still need their. It's like it should always be fifty fifty. You know what I'm saying? It shouldn't go one way. I know I have a, a, when I brought when I brought that up because. In Oklahoma, like it doesn't matter what it doesn't matter what she does, she could be a crackhead and then she still wins the case. And that's true in Oklahoma, and that's true a lot of times. The male will never win the case. I mean, yeah, that's that's um, that's America to you, man. Um, yeah. And I mean, there there are signs that, like you know, obviously, I do agree on some of the stuff, but obviously there should be fifty fifty. But at the end of the day, like, if the mother is shown that she is a crackhead, I believe, I mean, it will definitely favor the, the dad. But... Like, not all the time, because, like, I have a lot of friends that are going through it right now. Damn. I have multiple friends that are going through it right now. That I remember, I remember right. one of your homies that's going through that, through a divorce, and, like, she cheated on him, and then he, uh, she took the car and, and, and at the end of the house. Yeah. Or oh, yeah. he's still going through it right now. Like awful, they gave her, they basically gave her everything. He didn't get half or anything. They basically get she. So he's taking it to uh, Supreme Court. Man, for that, yeah. I, I, I would, I would shake, yeah. bro. She, she cheated and she got the house and the car, bro. I'm like, damn, bro, that's crazy, dog. Yeah. Crazy. That's that out there. That's 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 not cool. That's that's insane. That that there. That's the setup. That he was. He set himself up for disaster, dog. <laughs> well, that's yeah. the thing, though. Is like there's crazy bitches that are that are you know winning. Uh, you know, yeah, yeah exactly. who are starting yeah. shit. You know, what I'm saying and winning. You know, so <laughs> that's Western society, though. You know, you that's that's Dude. fucked up about the Western uh. society. Is that like women? They they would do that, and they do have that malice. In them to to destroy a man's life and career, yeah. just you know, they're just because they lost. Yeah, 
just because they cheated, just because they want out, just because they're not having fun, just because they have don't have attention, they want to do that. That's that's it. It's not like oh, some, like he's like not some petty stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. It, it's ridiculous, man. Like oh, I, I see this guy on Instagram. And I want to be with him. Like oh, yeah. you know, and, and I'm gonna divorce you so I can be with this guy for a couple months and then be sad forever. And then now I'm freaking old as fuck and I don't know who to marry now. It's it's destroying everyone's lives, bro. It's 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 a problem, man. And yeah. go ahead, go ahead, Philip. It's just like a, it's just a big stigma, you know, that we have as men. Uh, you you know, like so so the reason why I chose this video too, right, is that like uh, uh, you mentioned it, Philip. You know, stigma. The stigma is that like the dudes, you know in in uh, america are all evil they're all fucked up they're all you know raping women and they're all you know misogynistic and then they're raping all... raping <laughs> great I'll, I'll bleep that out when i when i edit this <laughs> but um but um but what else was but so yeah you know men are men are looked at you know like monsters of our society you know and and granted you know there are some monsters but then there's a lot of you know real decent people um uh, real yeah. de- decent men out there, you know what I'm saying, and and I think guys don't get credit. Not only that, but the statistics and these, you know, um, um, you know, these statistics they don't they don't quite get the whole picture, right? Because you see here, you know, like like how many of these ca- type of cases are happening, you know, um, uh, all over America, right? Where the guys don't, you know, um, um, call cops about you know being being abused, right? Because mm-hmm. Yeah. Because um, either either physical abuse or mental abuse, right? Because that's abuse is abuse, and I think yeah. I think the the narrative is, is just you know men are the problem versus yeah. you know we should punish the the action versus the 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 genders, right? Yeah. And what's then, the solution to this uh, in, in your mind? What do you think? What, what's the, what's the solution that we could cult- culturally, man? I mean. It, it, it's it's so hard, dude, because it, it's more complicated than just a a one and done. Do this and it fixes everything. Uh, because I think, I think, I think if if family values right is is practice in a way where you know guys treat women with respect and and you know, but then there's pressure of society and and women have their own fucking agenda of of this this you know over glorified man he should be making a gajillion dollars and 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 whatnot and there's so there's there's just so much going on yeah so so i don't know quite the answer to that question frankie but i know that the narrative of, or, or the uh, conversation should be changed about domestic uh abuse right be about domestic abuse the action instead of the genders you know right like the uh ember heard and johnny depp um oh, yeah. situation yeah, that's that that really proved a lot and that re- that's kind of where it all kind of started too like the really the t- tables has definitely turned yeah. because of that because she fucking destroyed his life his career and um it came back and bite her in the ass man she was one of the most hated person in the world oh, well, she had to move she we had to move <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah she's not in the u.s no more yeah. she yeah yeah i think i think she did she did move she did move she she owed like money she couldn't pay it um yeah. yeah yeah but yeah i'm telling you, man if she makes the only fans dude oh yeah you i'm know. telling you man the comeback i, I will pay <laughs> i will pay just to see some uh, that's uh i wouldn't <laughs> that's like that's the thing with men you know what i'm saying we 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 have our say and what we want to do and then but there's a lot of other men that are very thirsty <laughs> <laughs> the simps, the yeah. simps of, uh, of our society. Oh my god! Here's the one, man. Man, men, men can fuck an enemy. You know, like if you if she if he hates you, he'll, he'll still want to have sex with you. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. He'll fuck anything, dog. <laughs> That's a disgusting thing about men. Oh man, it's so true that I don't want I don't want to talk about it anymore, man. Yeah. <laughs> we we it's go to wars. Devil. We it's go to wars, devil. man, for women. <laughs> Oh my god. 